खुद आपको आइडिया हो जाएगा कि ये फील्ड आप दोस्तों की नज़रों से क्यों ओ जल रहा है क्यों आप दोस्तों को इस फील्ड के बारे में नहीं पता आप सिक्योरिटी सेफ्टी और दूसरे तीसरी जॉब्स के लिए भागते रहते हो इस कॉफ़ी शॉप में काम करने से आपको बहुत ज़्यादा बेनिफिट्स हो सकते हैं सिक्योरिटी वगैरह की जॉब्स में जो आपको सैलरी मिलती है वो इसका फिफ्टी परसेंट भी नहीं है दोस्तों दोस्तों वेलकम बैक टू अनदर न्यू वीडियो तो ये वीडियो आप दोस्तों के लिए बहुत ही ज़्यादा स्पेशल है मैं ऑलरेडी इंटरव्यू ले चुका हूँ आगे इस वीडियो में आप देखेंगे इंटरव्यू एक बरिस्टा का काफ़ी शॉप में कीनिया की एक लड़की काम करती है कोई भी क्वालिफिकेशन वगैरह नहीं चाहिए सिर्फ एक महीने में आप काफ़ी बनाना सीख सकते हैं और चार हज़ार प्लस सैलरी ले सकते हैं आठ घंटे ड्यूटी नौ घंटे ड्यूटी और बाकी भी बहुत ज़्यादा फैसिलिटीज़ आपको प्रोवाइड की जाती हैं बहुत ईजी काम है जिसके पास कुछ भी स्किल नहीं है जिसने मेट्रिक भी नहीं की हुई तो वो भी जाए इंस्टीट्यूट में सिर्फ चालीस पचास हज़ार पाकिस्तानी रुपीज़ लगते हैं और आप काफ़ी बनाना सीख जाओगे काम भी बहुत ज़्यादा ईजी मिलता है आप ये पूरा इंटरव्यू देखें असलम दोस्तों अभी मैं काफ़ी शॉप में मौजूद हूँ तो मैं आप दोस्तों को इस चीज़ से रिलेटेड इन्फॉर्मेशन प्रोवाइड करूँगा कि आप काफ़ी शॉप में एज अ बरिस्टा और वेटर कैसे काम कर सकते हैं क्या सिस्टम होता है चलते हैं काफ़ी शॉप में अंदर और जब मैं अंदर ही मौजूद हूँ तो जो अभी स्टाफ मौजूद हैं उनसे अभी बात करते हैं एक्सक्यूज मी हाउ आर यू सो यू आर बेरिस्ट आई थिंक सो वेर आर यू फ्राम एक्चुअली आई नीड सम इन्फॉर्मेशन आई हैव अब चैनल सो यू नो आई यूज टू गिव इन्फॉर्मेशन रिलेटेड टू जॉब सी टी सी दैट्स वाई आई वॉन्ट जस्ट लाइफ यू मिनट्स फ्राम यू इफ यू आर कम्फर्टेबल विद इट इट्स ओके या सो दोस्तों व्यूवर्स मैं आप दोस्तों को ये बताता चलूँ कि इंग्लिश समझना शायद आप दोस्तों के लिए थोड़ा डिफ़िकल्ट हो तो मैं बाद में कोशिश करूँगा कि ट्रांसलेट भी कर लूँ आप लोगों के लिए तो अभी ये जो बरिस्टा हैं यू आर फ्राम कैनिया यस तो ये कैनिया से हैं सो यू डेफिनेटली डोंट नो अबाउट हिंदी सो आई विल टॉक विद यू इन इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज सो वुड यू लाइक टू इंट्रोड्यूस यूर सेल्फ इफ यू डोंट माइंड हाउ लॉन्ग यू आर इन कतर ओनली वन ईयर सो यू कैम इन बरिस्टा वीज़ा और हाउ यू एबल टू जॉन एज अ बरिस्टा यू आर हैविंग विच क्वालिफिकेशन आर समथिंग टू वॉन्ट टू टेल हाउ अ पर्सन कैन जॉन एज अ बरिस्टा Madam Rania Sheka, Madam Rania. Yes. Yeah, she provided for me a visa from Kenya, and that's how I, I am able to work with her. So she provided you visa for barista. Yeah. Yes. And uh, can you tell me about how uh, much fees you was paying for uh, that school from where you learn this coffee? Did you see? Oh, uh, from my country. Yeah. How much the fees generally? Thirty thousand. जॉब Okay, it depends in some companies. Mm -hmm. You you're provided with food, accommodation, and transport. So obviously your your salary will be a bit low. But for me, I have my own room, my own transportation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so my package is a bit higher. Oh well, yes. So on average, on average, uh, how much a barista can earn? For my information, I think four thousand, four thousand five hundred. Four thousand five hundred. Yeah, that's what barista getting, and if someone is very professional barista, six head thousand. barista, yeah, six thousand plus, yeah. and if someone is junior barista, like without experience anything, three thousand three hundred five hundred. Yeah. After institute, after uh, having classes from institute, a person would be eligible to get four uh, thousand, I think, yeah. because he would be able to make R T T C yeah. something like that. You are right now making a coffee, yes. Yeah, yeah. So you can continue your work as well. So oh, I will. I'm making share. a hot chocolate. So yes, yeah. and you will make art also. That design I saw in Facebook, internet, etc. Yeah. So that's nice. And you know, many people don't know that these arts are made by hands. You know, <laughs> before I was also thinking that this art is used to make with some kind of machines, etc. No. 
so uh, after coming to Qatar I able to know that no professional baristas are making arts like this so there's a thing that uh, if a company is not providing you accommodation transport food etc food for food in cafeteria I think like many cafeteria have someone can eat etc like this but uh, food allowance is provided by the person and this is celebrity's cafe cafe from Rania Ibrahim I think she is a big celebrity and uh, that's the thing so so I will ask I am Yash. making uh, hot chocolate mm -hmm. yeah maybe next time I will show you how to make a coffee latte or a cappuccino yeah, so uh -huh. you will allow me to make next time video also yes yeah inshallah inshallah yeah. so nice of you thank you wow such a nice art yeah. such a big heart and nice art so there's nothing I want to ask a very important question from you that is uh, like what's the benefits and what's the drawbacks of a barista job what's that uh, what's the benefits uh, or what's the advantages and what's disadvantages of this job okay for me uh, I do it out of love I do it out of uh, I love my work so uh, you are enjoying yeah I am enjoying work. my work actually I don't find it as a difficult task I'm and, enjoying my work. And to be honest, this uh, job is uh, also very nice, like not too much chick chick. No one will say anything to you. You are make, doing your own work like this. Because yeah. uh, in other works, like if someone is doing labor work or someone is doing a better job, etc. He has to deal with supervisors, managers, etc. For you, you don't have to deal with anyone. You will just stay with your uh, coffee yeah, machine. Uh, yeah, so... <laughs> That's the thing, and uh, for you, you don't have any kind of disadvantages, huh? So uh, you do yeah. Okay. Anything a person can feel bad in this job. So as you are not a. So. Okay, we go outside. You will show me your cafeteria also. So. This is cafeteria cafe, I think. So, wow, what a nice place! I used to come here a long time. I have also uploaded videos. This cafe is very nice cafe. Yeah. Mm. Very nice place, and you also have big LCDs like LEDs. People yeah. want to watch football matches, yeah. cricket matches. They can watch, and this all uh, lighting is very nice. And because of Ramzan, they have a special uh, event designs also. So, I just want to ask uh, a question: that for this job, you don't uh, have to deal with like uh, you are supposed to know English, Hindi. Does not even matter, I think. Okay, language does yeah. not matter that much. Yeah. Because there's different type of coffee, mm -hmm. and there are different types of taste also. Yeah. So maybe for you, you want uh, cappuccino mm -hmm. with sugar, mm -hmm. and maybe someone else they prefer it without sugar. So some will say cappuccino, normal with sugar. We have different type of meals like almond, coconut, yeah. low fat, full fat. So. You have to know which kind of milk, you have to to learn, to, yeah, to talk with to people, understand to understand what people. they want. Yeah, what, what people want, because you need to to fulfill the desires of, the, of your customers. Yeah, that's uh, what I understand, but the main thing is, main concern is if a barista yeah. uh, learn only how to make coffee, etc. in our school, but he don't know how to speak English or he don't, does not that's have any not big qualification, because a uh, waiter will deal, I think. Yeah. And where will come exactly. and tell you? Uh, mostly, uh -huh. in most uh, big cafeterias, mm -hmm. uh, it's easier because they have waiters. But for us, it's a small cafeteria. Mm -hmm. We deal with, we, we deal with uh, few customers, so yeah. I'm able to handle my, all my customers. But yes. if 
by a chance we get our good cafeteria, they have waiters, yeah. of which they will take all the information and they will bring it to you. And uh, I'm sorry, just uh, can you speak a bit louder because I don't have mic, so maybe our voice would not go clear. So another thing is uh, how many... So can you tell me about how many duty hours you are working? Like. Okay, so now I'm working six hours because of Ramadan, but on normal days I work only eight hours. And one hour break uh, yeah, if you want. So, so hours, And you also have off days? off days like yes. once, uh, in once in a week off days yes. and uh, it's uh, quite a very interesting job that you are, are smiling interacting with different countries yeah, of people yeah. like this yeah you meet different uh, kind of people yeah. and you have to be gentle to them and, and it's a good job if you know how to make coffee it is easy to find a job or it is like very difficult that people have coffee you know, if you have experience if you have you know what I noticed that people are not going to this field as much as they are going to uh, other fields. Like uh, here, if they have uh, they have this skill how to make coffee, I also know that they would able to get job very easily. But they have other skills, too much competition. They could not able to get job in Gulf countries in hospitality field. If you have like it is not very difficult. I only it take one month or two month to learn how to make coffee. For me, I learned uh, within one month I was able to learn. So, as you guys uh, have listened, that only one month you required. If you don't know how to speak English, if you don't have any education, you can go to a coffee shop and you can learn from any institute that how to make coffee etc. Then. It would be nice. So I think you are a bit busy also and I have taken all the information I guess. Anything if I would uh, like to uh, tell to my uh, viewers, I would also approach to you again. Okay. Thank you so much Faith. So nice to talk with you. Thank you.